Hello, in this video we are going to see how to map requested medicines and download migration summary. If you are seeing this kind of notification that data migration is under process, do not make any transaction, then make sure you don't make any transaction during this time. Otherwise, it can cause problem in data migration process. And if you are seeing notification that inventory migration has been completed, then please click on migration summary. It will redirect you to the new page. And here you can see your map medicine, pending medicine and removed batches, expired and negative stock. Other way to see the data migration summary is open profile account and settings and click on data migration. When you click on map to medicine, you can unmap any item using unmap button. If the item is not mapped perfectly, here I am clicking on this medicine and it is saying that the medicine unmapped successfully. When you click on pending medicines, here you can show all your pending items. When you click on map any item, then you have multiple options like you can map from web, you can upload images and you can delete the medicine too. If you click on the upload images, the item will be pushed to the mobile and remove from here. And if you click on delete, then the item will per get permanently deleted from the mapping list. If you want to map your medicine from web directly, then click on the map button, search the medicine you want to map your item. As here I am selecting this dollar packs confirming this if you want to download your migration summary report then click on remove the batches expired and negative stock from here you can download your report in migration summary report the first step is you can see the total item and batch wise count it is showing you the overall diagnostic report in the first step. In second tab, you can show all the stock from your big backup. In third tab, you can see the stock that is imported to eVital successfully. In the expired stock tab, you can see the medicines that are not imported to eVital because of expiry date item with ptr greater than mrp will be shown here you can also see the items with the blank hsn code which are imported to evital but hasn't any hsn code invalid mrp because zero is not a valid mrp again invalid ptr zero is not a ptr you can also see the tab of top 50 items by quantity which has the highest quantities you can also see the top 50 items by your ptr valuation in this diagnostic report thank you